<laughs> she says it's comfy. <laughs> Is that yummies? Body the pad. You see you? <laughs> you see you? This is my cousin Abby. Is your birthday coming up? Good morning, everybody. I hope you liked the little bit of footage of my little cousin Abby. Christina babysits her, and so she was over at my mom's. And it was so nice to see, you know, one of my little cousins. I'll see more tonight. I'll see a lot more at the shower tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I can't wait to show you everybody. I am taking a little trip around town to, to run some errands before the shower tomorrow. I have to get my eyebrows done. I have a couple little things I need to pick up. So I'm gonna take you along with you. It's 45 degrees. I'm somewhat bundled up, but it feels so good to... I love this weather. It just feels so good. Okay, so I'm at Target. I'm only going in for nylons. Only nylon, Sarah. Only nine. Okay, I made it out with only one, one detour. That's not so bad, right? One little make. Okay, so I am done with all of my errands, and now I'm gonna show you, I hope, I don't think this vlog will go up tomorrow before the shower, if not, I hope that Christina won't watch it, but I wanted to show you guys what we got her. So, her fiance Grant, he grew up all around the world, so he, he his family did um, Teach America, so he grew up in the Philippines and Africa, and not only, does he have that as his background? He also, him and Christina, really like the idea of traveling, and I know that they're gonna travel with their baby. And um, that is what their nursery is actually gonna be themed. It's gonna be animals, not like baby animals, but just like travel and adventure and pictures of where he's lived and all of that. So, Christina's favorite park is Epcot. And so this is like the biggest, like the, the big part of her gift. But the last couple of times that we went to Epcot, we got her the passport and we had all of the messages written out to Violet. So I'll show it to you. So this is only like $10 at Epcot, which it's a really cool souvenir. One, it comes with this nice big Epcot button. And then this is like the big portion of it. So the passport. And then, so I put her Violet's little picture there, filled it out for her. So I went to every country and they wrote a message to Violet instead of me. So this one says, welcome to the world, Violet. Um, this one was from China. It says, dreams come true, welcome to the beautiful world. This one is a long one from Germany. What other ones are cute? So she got this little tiny zoom zoom. It's like actual paper that they had made um, from Japan. And then this, they wrote their message in Arabic, but then in her name, they made it green. It's so pretty. Um, this one from Paris said that we can't wait for you to come visit Disney. So yeah, this is like the more you know, little sentimental gift for her, but the rest of our gift is also themed after travel. This is like what those travel rapidy things so she can go on all our adventures. And then this will go in the nursery. They're actually having it repainted um, this color and it's all travel themed. So this is just from Marshalls, so cute. And then this is, has a map in the background and it says wherever you go, go with all your heart. So that is the gift from Peter and I. Um, and then, from my older sister and I, we got her, it's called, it's called Posh Peanut. So this is a robe. Ooh, it's, it's not satiny, it's nice and soft. 
slash the robe. And then this is a little hat. And this, I'll leave this in. This is a little bow that is like a headband to go on violet. And then this is a swaddling cloth. So Christina, while she's in the hospital, her and Violet can match. So she'll have the robe and it's the exact same print and the exact same fabric. And then she can decide if she wants to put the little hat on her or the bow. Um, so we had already gotten her some stuff from Lush um, that we actually already gave her just so that she could, you know, relax and whatnot while, while she's preparing for the baby. So this is kind of the second half of our gift. So now I'm just gonna wrap all of this before Christina gets home. She's still babysitting. Um, yeah, and then my mom and I are gonna start working on the favors for tomorrow. So, like I said, like every minute I'm here is planned to the T, but I have like a half hour, so I'm gonna get this all wrapped up. So Christina is in here, and Violet is here. I'm gonna get some tags and put it on there. So that's one. Thing. Today is the day. I'm gonna go check out Hollywood Studios Christmas decorations, and it's gonna be great. Oh. Today is the day. Got my ears. I'm gonna tuck this hair up there, but it's not gelled, so I gotta get that figured out. But in a couple hours, I still have work to do um, for my work. Been working from home, like I said, because of the dog. Um, but I'll be going to Hollywood Studios tonight for Fantastic Fridays, and they're doing the holiday parade filming, and they have all the decorations. And I didn't realize it, but they actually light up all the decorations at night, so I'm super excited. And they just announced that there's an annual pass holder exclusive preview for their like Sunset Boulevard show Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday this week. I hope I can make it on one of them, maybe Sunday. But uh, I wanted to show you, since Sarah doesn't vlog at home during the day while she's working too often, but I want to show you how difficult it is to get some work done with this little gal. So here's our setup. I currently this is my work laptop playing Crazy Bun Club stuff with my coffee and some snacks. Here is our Mac that we use to edit our vlogs. And here is this Banshee. She just sits here waiting for you. Waiting. And then the second you sit down and you start working, she starts that. Good afternoon, everybody. So, work is done for the weekend. Eva set. I really wore her down with the a walk I took her on earlier. So she is home napping. I am ready for Phantasmic Friday. And I've obviously you can tell that I'm ready for the Christmas decorations. I'm interested to see what's going on with this recording because last time we were here in 2011, they did no other recording at any other park. So I'm interested to see what they're gonna do with the filming today here at studios compared to Animal Kingdom tomorrow and Magic Kingdom the rest of the days. So, we will see. It's very sunny right now. Oh. Oh. Look at those decorations. And I can already see through the gate. Christmas trees galore. This is gonna be good. Oh, look at more decorations. All the good stuff. Look at they have the back way open for Fan for Phantasmic Beauty and the Beast. How's it going? We got everything out. Look at all these decorations. Woo! I see a stage down there. It looks like it's a normal stage, but we. Shall see. And this, everybody, is what Christmas Day Parade. This is what Christmas Day Parade filming looks like at the Magic Kingdom. Look, they got all Sunset Boulevard set up. And a cool stage here. It's very cool. 
they are being a little sticklers about staying on the street. So what I'm gonna do is that they turn it into two one ways. So what I'm gonna do is just walk back and forth down these streets. Excuse us. So, from what I've picked up, they have Hanson performing tonight. I called our friend who's Joe, who's obsessed with Hanson, to let her know. And she said Leah Michelle's also going to be here this weekend. So I'm not sure where Leah's going to perform. It could be either Animal Kingdom tomorrow or Magic Kingdom the rest of the weekend. So check this out. Look at this production. They're getting everything set. I might miss. I might miss Fantasmic for this. Let me go check out the Christmas tree and everything else because they're just doing mic check right now. And I will come back and check out what's going on with this stuff after that. I went to go find some of it to see if we know any cast members working, but look at this. Look at that Santa Claus. It's like a Coca Cola Santa Claus. And then, let me come over here. I'm trying to do a better job at not covering the microphone today. Oh my. Jingle bells. This is great. I cannot believe it. It's Christmas season in Disney parks. I honestly, besides before we decided to move here, I didn't know when we would be down here next because it was so difficult. Look at that reindeer. It was so difficult. It, there's no good time to come down on a vacation living in Chicago because of all of the fun-filled holiday festivities we have planned with the family. But we live here now, so we gotta soak it all in. I don't even. I... They got all the music out too. They are. I knew. I heard that they had everything out, but it's just not the same as being here and feeling it and experiencing. Look at this. Look at that wreath. Oh, I'm gonna go check out um, near Voyage of Little Mermaid. Not Voyage of Little Mermaid. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna go check out Voyage of Little Mermaid and Toy Story and then I'm gonna head back to the stage and see if I can see any fun going on over there. But I know we talk about Florida skies a lot, but Chicago is showing up tonight. Okay, start the vlog. Okay, so I'm at the Walsh's house now and I have a new cameraman. Do you want to show yourself? No. No? Okay. Well, he's going to show you some gymnastics later, right? No. No? <laughs> yeah! Yeah, he will. Hold on, so it, when it's recording, it says it right there, okay? Oh, uh, two. Slide in the bottom, make two flashes. Okay, what's your dance? Oh, yeah, you can dance. I'll record you. No, we just had done tumbling. Like, I, oh. I never did. Yeah, Maddie. Now you're gonna do splits? Oh, jeez. Why are you going to be doing gymnastics? Okay, first go to Little List. Do a trick, do a trick, do a trick. Okay. Of gymnastics. Oh, nice. Wait, you ride backwards. <laughs> So me and Sammy have a lot in common, right? Yeah. Do you want to tell them what? No. What? I'll say yeah. one and then you say one, okay? <clears throat> Why? Yeah. Okay, so our names both start with an S mm -hmm. and then an A. Then <laughs> both have blonde hair. Let's say your both May born and born in May. 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 What's your middle name? Marie. Yeah. Both of our middle names are Marie. Mm -hmm. And we're both a middle child. Right? Yeah. That's a lot in common. <gasps> you guys need to see what my dad just did. Oh my gosh. You need to see this. I caught it. Yeah, I caught it. Jeez. It literally just sounds like a recording. Yeah, I am. I 
Oh, what? oh yeah, you are. Okay. I'm My dad made a huge mess. Yeah. Okay, right now, we're going to be showing you guys our gymnastics. Going to be making it quick. And I have my leotard on, yeah. and my gym shorts on, and I'm ready to go. So I want to learn longer, so I said I got it. That's why. Hi! We're going to be doing one gymnastics. Got, one time I got hurt on one of my hands and on um, one of my toes. It's going to go Mallory, me, Sam, Maddie. Yes. Wait. Okay. Let's see. And then it's Sarah. Splits. Levi, now you do the splits. Okay, now Sammy, you do the splits. And now I do the splits. Hands up. Next. Cartwheels. Wait, I was going to do the splits now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not quite. Get in your Come on, Sarah. Sarah. I have a leotard that's super cute, and the back of it is super awesome cute. Inside it was upside down. <laughs> and I have eyeballs, nose, lips, mouth. I'm your pet. My sister. Take me on a walk, Mando. No. And my mom. Hello again. And my brother. Slackers. My sister again. Who am I? Sarah again. Do you know what I am? What am I to you? Aunt. No. No. An aunt. Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> I'm your cousin. Yeah, she's actually my cousin. Remember, you called me once your old, like your old friend, or your like adult friend. <laughs> <laughs> my adult friend. Hey guys, it's me again. Obviously, in the other one, you didn't see this. And I got the dog. Walk me. Got the dog. That's a what? really weird dog. So, coming to our CO2 test. It is on a In five, four, three, two, one. All right, they definitely changed things up since last time I was here. It looks like they do a cast member ticketed event for people to be in there. Maybe they're not cast members. I don't know what they are. But I think they're cast members. They had special tickets to be in the area for the filming. And this line is right here. Let me, let me switch the camera on. But the trick, the trick is they can't really ask me to leave or stop or do anything because 
I'm just walking, walking in a circle. I'm not stopping, I'm not trying to snag a spot to watch the band. I'm just walking around it. Hopefully when uh, there are some guests that have stopped and gotten like little, a few little spots that they weren't told to leave yet. So I'm hoping that when the band comes out, I can at least get a quick, a quick peek or a little listen before. Now they have a, an audience like pump or up guy on stage now to get the band or the, the, the guests or cast members, the audience ready. So under one of the ears, right under the white part of the ear, is one of the actual switches. You do end up getting one of these. There you go. Cool. Cool. Once again, guys, it is because uh, obviously Hanson is pretty popular here tonight. Uh, we're going to try to get as many of their fans in here tonight. So let's make friends with each other and spend a good time. Right? I'm playing right now, Julianne. And he's playing Nick. <laughs> and Chris, as our camera moves toward us, you guys fill in behind him. I'm pretty certain the guy who's the audience pump-up guy is, if you've stayed at the Disney Resorts and you've gone not to Stacy's channel, but to the DVC channel, the guy that is in that, I believe, is the audience pump-up guy tonight. That's funny if it is, because we had during a 2011 filming in Magic Kingdom, our pump-up guy was the original Ken from the Barbie and Ken stage show, however long ago that was. Since when did that cool movie magic show start? That's incredible. I wanted to show you guys the tree at night all lit up with these ornaments. And that recording thing just got real. Nick Lachey and Julianne Hopper are going to be there as the hosts. And tomorrow, Animal Kingdom, my goal tomorrow, Darius Rucker is there. I need to get tickets or something. But look at this beautiful tree. It is Christmas time in Disney World. First big old Christmas tree. And look at these. These are light up Christmas ornaments. Oh my god. Look at the reflection. Tower Terror has got projections on it like a big gift and they just lit up all the stars. I've been doing the same lap over and over again but I gotta deviate and I gotta show you guys these lights. Oh, oh it's beautiful and oh it's so good. I got Hanson performing behind me. I got lit up Christmas stars down Sunset Boulevard into the Tower of Terror as a front, as covered in peppermints. It's been a lot of fun, but my time is limited. I can't walk around anymore because they shut down behind the stage. So I'm like right behind this store with that car. 
and I know slowly they're gonna tell all of us to leave too, but right now we're completely out of the shot. Nick Lachey and Juliana Huff were supposed to be on stage, but they messed up Nick's outfit. They sent him out with the wrong one in. So I think they're finishing up the Hanson recording and then letting them go on stage. much later than I anticipated for that filming. I, they're actually still going, but um, I wanted to get a different angle of the fireworks for you guys, but I have to go. It's getting too late, so I'm at Starbucks. They're still open some, for some reason. Literally everything else is shut down. I'm just gonna get some water and then head out of here. I probably should go home because I want to get this vlog edited and put up early for you guys tomorrow, but I might go see Thor. Don't know, Movie Pass is kind of an addiction now, so. We'll see. It depends on how I feel when I get in the car and I sit because all those laps tired me out a little bit. But that was awesome. Super cool to see all that. Uh, Cameron, can you help me please? We can have any of our taller people just come in front of your stomach. You guys are beautiful! Well done! All right, everybody. I'm on the I'm on the phone with Peter. It's me in Florida. <laughs> I'm not in Florida. <laughs> so the intro, the outro is just me tonight. Peter, okay. So Peter has a deep voice to begin with. Over the phone, it's even more difficult to understand him. So I don't know how it's going to be through the speakerphone to you guys. But we're both here to say. One, two, three. It's good to be home. Good night. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.